a patchy red tide bloom is plaguing the beaches of southwest Florida. But this event is nothing new. It actually started as a late season bloom back in November 2020. The current red tide bloom event started about two weeks after Hurricane Ada came through. Uh, Southwest Florida, Lee County, Cape Coral, Captiva have seen the effects of the Florida red tide bloom on and off ever since. Red tide is the common name for a microscopic toxin releasing algae in the Gulf of Mexico. What makes this species so unique is that the toxin can also aerosolize, meaning that it attaches onto sea salt particles in the air and it can move on shore with winds causing respiratory irritation, coughing, sneezing, itchy eyes. For those visiting Florida's southwest beaches, the best advice is to check ahead. If you're going to Florida, you can still go to the beach. This bloom is very patchy. So check visitbeaches.org to find out where the effects of Florida red tide are, where there's respiratory irritation and dead fish, and, and avoid those. 